pack codes. And I like to make it kind of fun. I like to do some like trivia. I'll, I'll do some that are just like random. I'll just randomly select somebody. Uh, but I think people enjoy doing like some trivia. Some lock trivia. Doing pretty cool. How are you? I'm pretty good too. I'm just pretty tired, so I don't know how late I'll go tonight. <laughs> you're good, not cool. No, you're cool too. You're cool. Well, like, can you guys let me know if um, there's any audio sync issues, like webcam and the video, the audio match slash music is not too loud or too quiet? I'm trying out a new playlist today. Um, why did it end already? So yeah, let me know if you guys think it's uh, too loud, too quiet. Hey, Lol Cloud, how's it going? Fury Cloud says, I've been watching the stream for five years, just give me the pack so everyone's happy, easy peasy. <laughs> yeah. Because I've been streaming for five years. It's a little bit risky playing the second mad scientist in case the first one pulls out dupe. Because I don't, really, I really don't want dupe mad scientist. But I think we just risk it here. <laughs> It's possible, like, even if it pulls out dupe, I may be able to trade this mad scientist off before before he kills it. Actually, did I mention him from the future? Wow. Fancy. Alright, ice block first. Please ice block first. Always ice block first, then dupe. Damn it. Oh no. Maybe he won't trade. I doubt it though. Risk it for the biscuit? Well, I guess pulling out two mad scientists is not the end of the world, because then it does mean we get to pull out the rest of our secrets, so. It's just like, I would have liked to save the dupe for Emperor. So maybe. If he pulls out dupe, then we play the. We play the second mad scientist. It'll pull out another dupe, and then. Then we play the Emperor. But maybe he just goes face here. Maybe he just plays Shredder and goes face because he doesn't want to set up the second Mad Scientist. Do you think is Do you think fatigue is viable at the moment? Uh, what kind of fatigue? I have seen some fatigue mages. They run like Death Lord and Cold Light Oracles and um, Reno. So there are definitely. Fatigue decks. Also, Fatigue Warrior, too. I think it's, I think it's probably still viable. So I want to set up the second dupe. So I can play Emperor. And dupe the emperors. Fatigue mage, yeah. So fatigue mage is, I think it's viable. Hey, dragon spank, welcome to the stream. You've seen fatigue priest too? Oh yeah, fatigue priest is a thing. That thing is pretty annoying. And basically, in tomb allows them to. It's like gang up in mill rogue. It allows you to pack your, you know, put more cards into your deck. So. Imagine fatigue anything is boring to play. It's just really long games, I guess. But I imagine if you play it well. If you play it well, it's still like interesting to play. Oh by the way, um I don't know if, like how many people have seen one of the giveaways before, but I remember 
one of the annoying things when buying these pack codes is that like it used to be they 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 just took a picture with like all these little strips of paper with pack codes on so it's not like you, like, you can't even copy and paste the codes which is really annoying because then you have to like type it you have to type it out to everybody and then you may even like make typos and it's just it's just annoying and i'm glad that the vendor is like being less lazy now and actually just giving you the text and so you can actually copy and paste that now Wow. Just ignore it. Okay. So his biggest thing is going to be um, 7 health. This guy's going to be 7 health. So I think we just play... Oh, wait, I thought I had two explosive sheeps. Never mind. So what do I want dupe? I mean, pretty much the only thing that's gonna get duped is the abomination at this point. So the only thing I won't die is this is the mysterious challenger. Um, everything else will die because this basically does a flame. This basically does a flame strike to the board. Um, But he shouldn't be able to pop the block here either, because Mr. Challenger... We take 2 from Abomination, so we have 12. Mr. Challenger does 7. Uh, he doesn't have enough... Well, he could have True Silver Consecration. Face is a place, Repentance value. Repentance value there. And then the consecration or the flame strike doesn't like quite kill off the emperor as well. So he has to decide whether or not he wants to kill the emperor still. The nice thing is it clears the board without triggering any of like avenges and crap. Alright, so you have the consecration. Now now he clears the emperor. Hey Lower Waka Cho, how's it going? And Danny, welcome to the stream. Divine Winker. What a Winker. The most Divine Winker of them all. I think I want to play Abomination just to clear out this dude. And then probably Giant still. And just heal up and we can set up another um... no we don't need the ice block yet ice blocks not get, is not gonna get popped right we can set up abomination um, second mad scientist whenever he pops the first first block yeah it was on his turn so no avenge winkers winker baby rage That divine wanker. Like even though he's drawn a lot of cards, I don't think he has any cards that really answer the board. Alright. That does allow him to pop the block. But then again, he's sending everything to face, and then that means he can't deal with the board. And then he has to punch he has to punch eleven to face to just pop the block, but it doesn't actually deal eleven damage, it just pops the block. So the nice that's an, one nice thing is that we're still at eleven health. And we can just BGH. And then we can echo as well. Uh probably so BGH. Do we have enough mana for everything? This is eight mana here. Um so I'm gonna trigger the I'm gonna trigger the get down with this guy. Hopefully it lands on the mysterious challenger. And then I want to echo up everything here. I want to echo including the Lothab though. Nice. Okay. And then re redemption. Yep, it's fine. 
Uh, I guess we can go ahead and echo a mad scientist as well. We want to set up mad scientists on the board too to trick um, to set up the second uh, ice block. I guess this still dies to second blessing of king, second true silver. Although not all secret paladins run the second true silver. Got him. <laughs> 